So as many of you know, last month, lots of exclusive information was being put out about Breakpoint from a bunch of different media outlets. Now, one specific media outlet, which is IGN, they had an exclusivity deal with Ubisoft, and they were going to be putting out a bunch of exclusive information for the month of May on Breakpoint. Well, today, some brand new gameplay was just released by IGN, showcasing a wolf camp being captured and cleared. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys some of that gameplay, as well as going over the new things that we got a glimpse of in this video. So of course, like always, Always, let's waste no more time and let's get right into the video. In the gameplay we got today, we were given a closer look at one of the wolf camps that will be found throughout Aurora. Along with that, we also got a closer look at some of the new drones, two of them to be exact. First one being the Malthus drone, which are the flying ones. Now, unfortunately, we haven't really gotten much information or actually seen too much of these drones, but according to IGN, they are extremely fast and extremely dangerous, like I'm going to be showing you guys in the gameplay in the back. Now, based off of the gameplay, the drones seem to go down fairly easy. Uh, considering they are level 80 but of course we don't exactly know what level the ghosts were during the recording of this so overall it's safe to say they're going to be an absolute nightmare to deal with when we start off the game but regardless when attacking a wolf camp these should be the main priority at first once they have been taken down the next priority should go to the car drones which we had already seen uh, these kind of in action during the gameplay reveal but ultimately once you clear it out the camp you'll complete the mission and be rewarded with what seems to be uh, faction points and another type of currency which i believe is pronounced as creds unfortunately not a really long gameplay but definitely something for everyone to snack on till e3 when we hopefully get some more solid gameplay and information of course for those of you that were not fortunate enough to get access to the technical test you guys now have a general idea of what the game will look like with hud and of course get a closer look at the other small details that i may have missed not gonna lie we got a lot of really cool details in this i actually didn't really get enough time to really go into it and break it all down because i am in the process of getting ready to head on to la for the e3 From from the moment that this video goes live it will probably be about t minus one day until i'm out of here so i'm kind of getting all of those last minute preparations in but i was in the process of packing and doing all of my stuff when i noticed that this gameplay was made live so i wanted to bring this video to you guys as quick as possible so like i said before i'm more than 100 percent sure i did miss a lot of big details in this so if you guys do see it make sure to let me know in the comments and keep everybody else informed as i've been saying for the last few days over on my community tab if i do get any type of exclusive information over at e3 that i can share with you guys i will definitely Definitely be posting it up on the community unfortunately i will not be able to make a video until i get back from los angeles which will be on june 13th but i will most definitely be active in my discord on twitter and in the community tab so like always if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like on it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all types of breakpoint and wildlands content once again don't forget to go and check out ign's video if you guys want to check out the entire gameplay that's pretty much going to do it for today's video so like always i will see you guys in the next one